Hello, welcome to this short video. In this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to update your edge devices on the fly using Flowfuse. So you can see on my table, I have several edge devices, starting with Revolution Pi, one of my favorite. Then we have Edge Pi, and this is the Raspberry Pi. And here we have Edatech HMI, which is also Raspberry Pi based. And we have a Re terminal, which is also Raspberry Pi based. So what you see on my device right now, they all are having Node-RED running inside, which is managed by Flowfuse. So basically, they are having Flowfuse agent, which is running inside. And this agent I can monitor remotely from my Flowfuse account. So let me show you that. So now what you see on my screen, these are the individual dashboards from all these edge devices. So they're running some sample code. So I just generated a sample code to show you what I'm going to, how I'm going to update that. So here you can see in my account, Flowfuse account, I have the status of my edge devices. So if I maximize that, you can see I have Edatech, Raspberry Pi, Reterminal, Edge Pi, and Revolution Pi. And these are the last known statuses. So all these edge devices are having these dashboards inside. All right. So let's say we need to make some update. So you can imagine a situation when you have several edge devices on your shop floor, and there comes an update, and you want to update all of them. OK, so how you can do that quickly? I can show you, you can do that in a fraction of a second. So I go to my Flowfuse. This is the instance which is running on my cloud. All right. So in this instance, uh, you can see this is the same dashboard here. I will update this instance. Let's say I want to add an extra gauge here. So I will take my gauge, and I want to add a tank level gauge. For example, I will call it level, and the rest is OK. And I will just check its size to make sure it fits and looks nice in my dashboard. There you go. I just connected that, deploy, and you can see in my cloud instance, this is deployed and it's working. Now I want to duplicate that to my edge devices. So <laughs> this is actually very, very easy. What you can do is you have to first make sure your edge devices are connected to Flowfuse. So these are linked and you can read in the documentation about the steps. It hardly takes two minutes for each device. And then all you can do is you can go to your instance. So that's my instance, which is running this code. I will go to my version history and I create a snapshot. Let's call it dashboard version two. All right. Set as target. You have to make it as a target. And this will take this instance, running instance from my cloud, deploy to, deploy to my edge device. And you can see that right away. One edge device is updated already. And you can also see the status in the devices. And you can see that how others are being popping up. So all the edge devices, one by one, are being updated in the real time from your server to your factory. How easy it is. There you go. All the edge devices are now updated with the new code, fraction of seconds. How cool is that, right? So now you can imagine you can use this uh, flow fuse in your factory and shop floor to update your edge devices. You can also monitor them. You can also go to the editor with the developer mode. All right. So thank you for watching for this quick short video. You know what to do. Go to flowfuse.com and give it a try. Thank you for watching. Have fun. Bye-bye.